the giveaway that I promised in 2015 December. $10 of Riot Points. That's enough to get yourself the hot new skin or a, better yet, a 3% chance at Chibi Gwen. Don't want to be one of those guys who gives subscribers stupidly high luck and it's like not really a pay to win, but it's like kind of pay to win. No, I'm a, I'm a reasonable man. All regular viewers are 10 times more likely to win this giveaway. Actually, you know what? That's reverse pay to win. How about all everybody's 10 times more likely to win? It's like in The Incredibles. It's like, if everybody's a superhero, that means no one is. Look at all these people subscribing to get 10 times more chances of winning the giveaway. All right, all right, all right. Subscribers, you get 10 times the luck and plebs, you get nine times the luck. All right. Our winner of this insane $10 RP giveaway is... No Snick on Step. A subscriber. Pay to win. Congratulations, No Snick on Step. You guys ever hear about the hot crazy scale? Where it's like the... It's like hella misogynistic, but it's like the the hotter the person is, the more you're fine with them being crazy. I learned it from uh, How I Met Your Mother. All right, I'm gonna play the ad break. I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey, did you know a large percentage of viewers are not actually subscribed to the channel? Please, if you enjoyed watching, consider subscribing to help me support my girlfriend's crippling boba addiction. If you are watching this, odds are I am pooping, eating, or browsing Reddit off camera. If you could just go ahead and smash that like button, leave an essay in the comments, and subscribe to my channel, that'd be pog as heck. But I wouldn't really see it because, well, I'm pooping, eating, or browsing Reddit, but it'd help us expand further, and I would love you even more. How hot do you find Annie? Oh, I mean, that's the easiest question in the world. On a scale of 1 to 10, I think my girlfriend is uh, 7. Actually, she might not be happy to hear that. On a scale of 1 to 10, I genuinely think my girlfriend is a 6. I'll see you guys after the ad break. You have now reached 100 D faces today. Why is everyone saying it's Jover? It's not Jover. It's not Jover, guys. I'm fine. Uh, Spark? Oh wait. Oh, it's a it's a five item start. Okay. Um, I hope I get a bow. I'm down for like Queen Sue's IE. It's looking like an Ionia start, so I don't want to play AP here. I do want to pre-level, but it might not be possible. Oh, never mind. Oh, I hit the bow, Pog. All right, now I get stars are born. GG. Oh, oh wait, I could actually take challenger heart here. Right, that's four challenger right now. I think I'm down. Dude, imagine. Oh, uh, if I get Stars Are Born, I would have gotten a two star Warwick. Or, sorry, I would have gotten a two star set right now. It would have been Jover. Alright, it's fine. I think it's still very playable. Um, How do I want to do this? I feel like Gwinsu's BT Dog is not bad. Okay, I'll, I'll do Gwen Sue's on Samira. Just because Warwick might get stun locked. This guy's level 5. Alright, come on, give me an Irelia or Samira. Neither. Uh, okay, this is a little shaky, but, but let me cook. I'm pretty sure if I hit one upgraded unit, I five streak. Get Ravenous Hunter on 3-2. I think I would literally nut. If I hit Ravenous Hunter on 3-2, I would literally nut. That's just like best in slot Warwick with Challenger. It's so free. I wish I had Real Samira. No, I've never gotten an opener for it. Real Samira is like, you get like four Samiras early game and three Cassios. Isn't Ravenous Hunter super nerfed? No, they nerfed the higher end of it. It's like, you can no longer get 50 stacks, now it's 40. But you are almost never getting to 40 stacks anyway. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? For real? Would I ever sell for 10 here? Probably not. Why is everyone saying Pepe W champ? Do you guys not like Q 
cute Korean girls performing. All right, if you don't like cute Korean girls singing, leave. We're going to do a genre swap. We're going to listen to something on the complete opposite side of the spectrum. Something that makes you go nodders. That's right, give it up for a very old band. Sum 41. I actually, I actually like this, unironically. Completely different kind of music, but I like it. It's when you want to let out the rage. Okay. You know what? Maybe it was that Irelia for two star Irelia. And then Slamic Guardbreaker. Oh. There's a saying. Never, Never mind. Fight on okay, I did this because I think that if you're gonna play Challenger Heart, JG, Gwinsu's Kalissa is like super legit. Oh, why is Samira good now? They buffed her animation, which was previously not working correctly. Uh, before she would like, before this patch, she would like stop to ask herself like, do I actually want to ult this guy? I'm actually down to slam this right now. She's like, do I actually want to ult this guy? Maybe. Okay. Pew. All right. Then she starts attacking again. Whereas uh, now she's just like, boom, boom, boom. It's very smooth. Okay. So if I have Challenger Heart, I'm immediately thinking you play six challengers ASAP. You could maybe do something with Ionia. The best play is if you get a challenger crest. Then it's like, oh, you just play the Ionia board. But now instead of four challengers, you have six. And then you put one of them on Karma uh, or Belveth or Ari. But yeah, I mean, Gwinsu's on four challengers, Samira. This is so strong early game. It, it was only, it's only good this patch. Cause now she like actually attacks very smoothly. If you actually want to play Samira Reroll, by the way, you should do blue buff on her, not Gwinsu's. I'm doing Gwinsu's as an item holder. Hello, get that bread, 91. Thanks for the sub. Is Rek'Sai carry good? Uh, only if you hit a lot of them very early, otherwise, no. Set! Alright guys, be honest with me. If you had to date one of the units on my board... Oh, sorry, one sec. If you had to date one of the units on my board, <laughs> which one would it be? It's Chover, man. It's Chover. That's not bad. All right, I'm actually down for Ravenous Hunter. Why are you holding Poppy Malkai? I'm holding it just in case I happen to hit Kalista. Maokai 2 is good, but now I need to sell. Level 6. I'm pretty sure I beat this. Alright, pray for Challenger Crest. Honestly, Ionian Crest is also playable. Then you can do Ionian Samira, then she goes Giga. More importantly, I think that's actually 6 Ionia on the spot. I'm also down for Ravenous Hunter. Uh, I don't think I'm rerolling, so it's not Silver Ticket. Ravenous Hunter. Ravenous Hunter. Juggernaut Crest? No. Ravenous Hunter. No. No Ionia Crest. No Challenger Crest. If only I didn't have Juggernaut on the board, then this would have been uh, one of my other Crests. Uh, it's probably just Harm Assist. Harm Assist falls into the category of like, it's not terrible, but there was just so many better ones I could have gotten. All right, I mean, it's fine. Roll once. No, I'm good. If I lose my, my, my streak here, it's fine. But like, my board's good. The only thing I could really do is hit like a Karma Warwick. Or I mean like, you know, fucking hit Yasuo, but that's not likely. I'm pretty sure my board's just crazy strong right now. Two star set really sells this. And Samira is actually a lot better than you think, because like, 
I mean, we, everyone knows she's good because they buffed her, but like, reduce their armor by 35 for the rest of the combat. That guarantees that any tank will eventually die. Right? Any tank will eventually die. I actually don't even think it's worth it. Yeah, that Bramble tank with 200 armor and the Warmogs, his armor is going to go from 200 to 170 to 140 to 110 and so on until it gets to zero and then you're doing crew damage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, nothing beats this for now. <laughs> yeah, see this Melkai? Like, he dies. He dies. He's now brought down to 100 armor. 60. 25. And he just dies. Meanwhile, my set Giga Chad. Samir 2 is just such an illegally good frontline. All right, now I'm down to go seven and roll for six Ionia or six Challenger, preferably six Challenger, which would mean hit a Kalista, Yasuo, or Kaisa and hit two out of the three. Uh, I have a Chain Vest here. The best thing I can get here is a Sword. It doesn't exist. Uh, maybe a Titans. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe a Glove. Please let me get this Glove. <laughs> oh. oh my God. Boom, boom, boom. What? That was level six. Wait, and then I roll one time and the crowd goes pogger. The crowd goes poggers. Yeah, I don't know. Definitely feels like the game wants me to win. There's more duck saying sorry about earlier. You have now reached 1000 pogs today. I even have six Ionia if I want it. Level seven, 30 gold, six challenger, two star everything. I've only rolled three times. Sell Jin for 30 gold. You think I'm not gonna win? Imagine not winning. Like, I don't care how tanky this set is. Samira will cut him down all the same. Wait. Wait. Uh-oh. Damn. That might be like a Vow on Warwick Diff. Although, I've never summoned that Vow, because I'm one bow off of a... Uh... Really, really good Kai'Sa items. Or one rod. Wait, who did I lose to? Samira! God, that is so unfair that he hit a Samira 2 with Gwinsu's. That's bullshit. Belveth! Uh-oh. Actually, Belveth with no items doesn't really do much. Okay, my Samira is falling off a cliff. Wait, yo, what the fuck? I just got Zeri or got Jinx Scion. <laughs> what? Robotic arm? Wait, that's actually like an entire pivot in one shop. Dude, I'm like, kind of thinking about it. Nah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick with my current build. Sorry, guys. I know it's a little veg. It's a little veg, but I, I would be pivoting into two people. And I'm not guaranteed to hit my units, whereas here I'm not contested, and I already have most of the units. Alright, Ionia Crest or Challenger Crest, it's a GG. Well, it's never Infernal Contract. Social distancing is really good here. Freaky Friday, not that great. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's social distancing. Alright, I'm down to sack and then roll it down at eight for a million gold. But yeah, social distancing on six challenger. The amount that you are these this these 30% AD and AP is getting multiplied so hard by such a ridiculous attack speed. So I actually need to get a Callista. Yeah, Callista 2, Kaisa 2, Yasuo, 
Uh, probably Shen for frontline and it's just six challenger. Not bad. I did not hit a challenger crest, so you can't play Belva. A little sad. There's like a small world where I hit Belveth and then I uh, play only four challenger. Okay, one more round and then I go in. Uh, a lot of this will come down to items. I have like a BT also, which is not bad, but I've got harm assist. I think they don't synergize that well. I'd rather just go full damage. I think Kai'Sa 2 will be the game winner here. They did recently buff Kai'Sa by quite a lot. It's like 10%. Uh, in an earlier, at the beginning of the set, she was ridiculously OP. Uh oh, this guy's challenger crown. At the beginning of the set, she was ridiculously OP. And then they nerfed her by like 30%, which is a lot. And then they recently buffed her by about 10%, which is nice. Why not rolling for days? Uh, combat augment, way more important than hit your board augment. Unless, unless you're going nine. If I was nine, I would take rolling for days. Cause like every roll at level nine is just such high value. I won, what the hell? I beat a guy who rolled down. Okay, someone's going for Kalissa three. So this might be kind of hard. Uh, best thing I can get is that Kaisa. I highly doubt I get it. Uh, after that, maybe Shroud. Maybe Titans. Oh, Titans, yeah, also is actually not bad. I feel like I'll never get the premium components. I'm gonna grab this Warwick to rebuild. I lose one gold, but I'm more likely to hit my rebuild of Warwick. Splash in here. I'm playing four Ionia right now, which is like not useful. Uh, it's definitely Shen in for Bastion Invoker. I might drop down to four Challenger. You have now reached 100 gems today. Okay, I think the board that makes more sense is play four Challenger, six Ionia, plus a Legendary. Because you can't do six Challenger and then three Ionia. Oh. Have left. Okay, so then it would look like this. And then... Yeah, that looks good to me. Okay, that looks so good. That This is beautiful. Holy shit. You are so fucking hot, Cassante. Like, this is a, just a beautiful board synergy-wise. I've solved it. I just gotta hit my two stars now. Well, I already did. This Kai'Sa is gonna do so much work. And then, six Ionia is a pretty good front line. This Kai'Sa has it all. She's got big damage from social distancing, big multiplier with uh, Guardbreaker JG, Gwinsu's to sustain, sustain into the late game, or scale into the late game, and then Harmasis to stay alive. This Kai'Sa is just a superwoman. If I was playing Kalista, then the Sun would have been perfect. I don't think I need her. Okay, also, am I really gonna play a Yasuo 3 here? That might be trolling. It's uncontested. I'll hold it. Maybe I natural like two more. But like, I'm basically just going nine now. All right, pray for good Yasuo items. Edge of Night, Titans, Guardbreaker, something. Uh, what do we got here? A spark for y uh, Shen? I think it's Guardbreaker. I think Guardbreaker Spark makes sense. Why not JG Ari? No, Spark is way better. It makes Kaisa do a lot. Alright, I'm done for this. Alyssa Nixon. Welcome. Wow, this is beautiful. Just live for like a little bit of time and then Kaisa kills everything. 
This is a satisfying game. Finally, a game gotten right. Oh, Aro's in. Let's go nine. Social distancing was such a huge hit. We are vengeance. Dodge Sucker. Hog, what a dodge. Ah, this poor guy is playing Karma. Ah, I remember back three days ago when I was the one playing Karma. Ah, what a horrible time. Oh, wait, did I say three days ago? I meant three games ago. God, that unit sucks. What is your strategy that is mentioned in your stream title? I play Caitlyn, I play win streak, I get five streak, I win the game. The only time it fails is when I don't get a five streak, which honestly happens quite often. Not the best strat, but I'm down. I'm down to make it my strat. What are you gonna add at nine? I was thinking about putting you into the board. What what synergies are you? What do you add to the team? Tell me. Can I sell it one more time? It's Jover. Okay. All right, I'll take the guy who said crippling anxiety. I was thinking about QSS Yasuo. But I believe in Ari, in her. I believe that uh, if anyone can beat me, then a two-star Ari would then beat them. Although, I was probably not supposed to... Okay, maybe a blunder. I don't think I was supposed to level here. I basically just made my board, like, 5% stronger at the cost of all of my econ. Like, am I... Do I really think this is a Senna 1 diff? Do I really think this is a Senna 1 diff? Wait, it actually might be. Wait, it actually is. Huh. I barely won that. Holy shit. Alright. Well, you've earned your spot, Senna. Until I hit a Heimer. Because I need a triple burn in here. Okay, this guy looks pretty strong. The synergies look very satisfying. Gunner got... Two star Aatrox, Heimer. Oh shit, Heimer too. Okay. What can I do against this guy? Hmm. My also needs an Edge of Night. Hang on, do I win this? Oh wow, let's go. Let's go, Kaisa. This Kaisa crazy. I can't believe I won that. Hello, Sugar Nipples One Two Three. Interesting sub name. Hello, Senna. This Kaisa is actually really good. I'm really happy she's playable. When back when she had 140 mana, she was really bad. For those of you guys who don't know, she was at 110 mana and then she was really OP. Then they nerfed her like really hard to 140 and she was useless. And then now she's at 125 and playable in my uh, in my IMO. All right, give me an RE2. Oh wow! All right, uh, Yasuo item. Is that ever a Hodge and I just go Infinity Healing? It might be Warmogs. Just so we don't die. I'm doing war mugs. Yeah, I think war mugs actually makes a lot of sense here. Because Yasuo does so much damage. My concern is that he gets one shot by the Zeri. Is Scion 2 better than Scion? Oh, it's better than Senna? No. 
I don't believe so. I mean, Silent 2 is great, though. Ow. Um, I need an R. Huh? What's this? What's this? Two women on his bench, and they're both beautiful. Okay, how do I beat this? He's like hella capped out. Uh, I need to like do something crazy with my positioning. I don't even know what to do. Okay, let's first of all let's make sure Cassandra gets a good ult. Shen is always on the side of Ari. Kaisa can be anywhere because she'll reposition. I don't want my Cassandra hitting that QSS. I don't want my Yasuo dying early. I gotta move him back a bit. Yeah, he's dying too early. Okay, that Velvet 2 is a problem. Fuck, it's not even that close. This Velvet 2 is just too good. Think, Albert. Think. Dink donk, dink donk. What can you do? There's there's not enough money to like maybe I was thinking like, oh you swap out Irelia, Set, and Karma for like other units, but there's not enough time for that. Or is there? Probably not. We are vengeance. Okay, um. Sorry, Karma. We're kinda inting you. Okay, Kasante gets a pretty good ult here. Yasuo doesn't get targeted first. He's definitely way stronger. I have to get like a really good fight RNG to win this. Holy shit. Oh god! I'm like thinking, what if I... It's probably weaker, but like... What, what I had wasn't working, so... Wait. Santes, get him quickly! Take these items, get him! Do something! Casantes, no! Nice try. Not a bad game. We almost beat the Giga Cap end game board.